Moving on, senior BJP leader Arun Jaitley in an interview to NDTV Srinivasan Jain has said that the party never arm-twisted LK Advani. He says that Mr. Advani repeatedly himself said that he wanted to contest the Gandhinagar seat. Take a look. But when you say that you, there's a lot of respect for the seniors, uh, you recently had another situation with Mr. Advani, who himself seemed extremely uncomfortable with the party's decision to, it seemed almost arm twist him to fight from the Gandhinagar seat, while he Arwani, actually wanted to fight from Arwani Bhopal. ji repeatedly had said that he would want to fight Gandhinagar. At the last stage, a suggestion came from the Madhya Pradesh unit that he could fight even Bhopal. The party had decided Gandhinagar. And he had, in all fairness, accused himself from that meeting, saying, it's my issue, therefore I won't participate. And then, as a gesture of respect to him, the party left it to him to choose between Gandhinagar and Bhopal. No, but that wasn't quite how it unfolded. Initially, you indicated very clearly that you wanted him to fight from Gandhinagar, and uh, he refused. He said that he wanted to fight no, Bhopal, and the, and the indication sorry, was very I'm much sorry. that he was being, I'm his hand was being forced. I'm sorry, the speculation in this regard is not correct. Till about four or five days before the decision was taken, he had clearly announced that his preference is Gandhinagar. Mm. At a later stage, a suggestion about Bhopal had come. The party decided Gandhinagar, but out of respect for him, we left the choice to him. And he then chose Gandhinagar in preference to Bhopal. Now, Mr. Jetli, isn't it surprising that someone like Mr. Advani would even have the shadow of doubt about a seat like Gandhinagar, which is in Gujarat, which is in Narendra Modi's bastion? Doesn't that indicate, as it did to some, that there still continues to be doubts and tensions between Maybe him and Mr. Mr. Advani Modi. have doubts. It's Mr. Advani who in the end chose Gandhinagar. He endorsed Gandhinagar as a seat. It seemed almost he was given no choice. Not at all. The, the party president made a public statement after speaking to him that I have left the choice to him. He could have chosen either of the two and we would have abided and respected his choice. Was it a genuine choice or was it a, a, a fait accompli presented as a choice? It was absolutely a genuine choice. And was the RSS also involved in mediating I, I a solution? So. I know it for a fact that they weren't.